Harry Song's music collaboration with Olamide, Orezi, Casey, and Iyanya turned out to be one of the biggest hits of 2015. The singer has released a new song, Baba for the Girls, with hopes the song will also hit jackpot. He paid us a visit and shared details of his upcoming album and more. Enjoy. Harry Sinokiri, better known as Harry Song, started out his career with Question Mark Entertainment before pitching his tent with the Five Star Music imprint. Few years after joining the label with a couple of hit singles under his belt, Harry Song has become one of the high-flying artists in the country. like nine years counting to today I was uh, with other people recording signed on pushing the brand and the music till we got to five star music and it worked and it's, it's working you know so a, a lot of things have changed the brand the package Harry song is Mr. Songs is serious business it's, it's really serious uh, business it's music business and the the five star platform has taught me a lot when it comes to the music business, you know, uh, there's, a, there's a lot to just pushing the brand, pushing the music and um, um, uh, connecting with the fans also. And uh, the money making part of the business is, um, I give it to the platform, I give it to the five star management and the whole thing. <laughs> In 2015, his song, Reggae Blues, featuring label mate KC, rapper Olamide, Shupe Rukruna Orezi, EME lead act Inyanya, became a hit, enjoying airplay for many months. Harry Song credits the success of his song and his career to the five star music label led by E Money and singer KC, whom he met several years ago. <laughs> I met Casey first. They used to come to the OJ's nightclub, uh, National Stadium, where I perform every Friday. So they come to encourage, they come to spray me, they come to uh, just have fun with the band, you know. So that was how I met Kim. That time they were still Casey Fresh. So that's how I met him. He shares the inspiration behind Reggae Blues, which is undoubtedly his biggest hit yet. Reggae Blues was inspired by people's story, people complaining about the relationship, people complaining about the friendship. This one is not treating me nice, this one is not... Uh, this one is cheating. That one is not doing well. This one is not happy. This, you know. So, but I just, I just wanted a happy song, you know, to encode everything, and I, I, I came up with that uh, piece. You know. So it's just one of those songs. So reggae blues affected everyone, you know, the platform. It changed the sound also, you know, people trying to revolve on that sound, you know. So, um, of course, it brought a lot of, it opened a lot of doors, meeting people all around Africa and, and the world, you know, traveling and seeing how people accept that sound, you know, especially when they say, Ibu, Yabu, we get a boo everywhere, in, in everywhere. You know, the acceptance and the love then also stepping up um, the brand Harry Song, you know. Then um, I think um, the, the sound was six months, seven months before now. It's like three months, four months. When you put up a hit single, it will stay almost a year. But right now, you just have to keep working and keep working and revolving. So Reggae Blues did change the sound. When we recorded the song, KC and E-Money, they were prophesying this is going to be a very big song, it's going to be a very big song. So, but for me, I, it was just one of those songs that we put together. I love the melody, percussions, and 
the ringtone on it you know i love the master tone on it the dun, 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 dun. i love the master tone on it so that was what would just carry me on the song till i was just watching it grow like a like a like a baby when you give birth to a child you see the child trying to to crawl trying to walk trying to call your name from mama 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 mommy he tried to call your name no it was just like that seeing the, the child grow to become that very big and become a master hit it's i'm i'm grateful to god and thanks to the fans. Moving on, Harry Song hopes to beat his past records with his latest song before releasing his brand new album. Um, we're working on the album title uh, Spontaneous, you know, uh, I have a lot of my friends on it, my colleagues on it. Um, it's going to be about Harry Song, Harry Song, Harry Song, you know, from where, I'm, uh, from where I started to where I am right now and where I'm going. We will have um, Pata Ranking, we have Pata Ranking on the album, we have M.I. on the album, we have Duncan Mighty on the album, we have Casey, we have Skibi on the album, we have uh, um, a lot more on the album, we have... Um, um, Shay on the album, we have, we have like them Yemi Alade on the album, you know, so people like that. Yeah. 